Member of Parliament for Dom Kwabinya and Minister of State in charge of procurement says her ministry is pushing for a 30% quota for the marginalized group, including the youth, disabled, and women in bidding government contracts. Speaking at a meeting with delegates at Dom Kwabinya in Accra, Adwa Safos emphasized the policy has been handed to the economic management team, which is headed by the vice president, and that will enhance inclusiveness in Ghana's procurement processes. We are trying to get out a policy of 30% for the marginalized groups. It's far advanced. We've handed it over to ETC, which is headed by the vice president. Very soon, we will launch that. And from there, being a policy, we can enact it into law so that it is not uh, only the big multinational companies that can bid for government contracts. Adjoa Safo said her ministry is investing in public sensitization and training in reducing procurement infractions as a ministry is only mandated to advise the president and not procure. The ministry, for instance, is the first of its kind. It will take time for people to understand what we do and our mandate, which is why most of the times when anything goes wrong, it's the us that they are pointing the fingers at. That is why we are working together with the authority which is mandated to do the regulation. So they are to check compliance. They are to check um, the approvals within the thresholds that have been given. The Dom Kabenya MP is seeking re-election. She said her good work is a trump card. I strongly believe that the good people voted me as a member of parliament to serve them with honesty and with humility. And I believe that um, for them to... Um, a nomination form for me even in my absence is a clear indication that indeed they want to retain me as a member of parliament. Meanwhile, major road projects in the constituency are at various stages of completion.